okay guys so as you can see i want to show you how you can edit this intro using your cap cut okay it's a very simple steps that you need to follow but before then i will download this okay remember the video i uploaded earlier i showed you how you can create a youtube intro for all your videos so i just want to do a, a few finishing touches and then i'm done now look at this first page where we are here there is something we need to add all you need to do is to click on it this way okay and then you go to elements look at elements click on elements and then you type corner like this then you search so these are different corners which of them do you want to use okay you look for the corner you want to use let's go for this one you click on it good it brings you here so the next thing you want to do is to begin to set it you will have to arrange it to fit into where you want it to be so you just keep it here at the edge okay like this and then you have to change the color here change the color to this you see that okay so we will do that for every corner that we have here the four corners that we have okay so click here to duplicate it when you duplicate you drag it down and then you change the position okay and then you copy again you drag to this place then you turn it around like this can you see that then you copy again take it there like this now do you see this very beautiful okay so the next thing you want to add is go back to your element and then type in record like this and then you search so we have different records here but well, the type that we need is the animated record. Can you see it? Look at it blinking here. Click on it. So when you click on it, it brings you here. Then you resize it and then you take it up here. Okay. And you leave it there. You can see it blinking, right? Good. So it beautifies the whole thing for you. And then right here, I want us to add another write up. Now, what is the main goal of your YouTube channel? Okay. This is the name of your YouTube channel, Ultimate Vid, and then always delivering the best, okay? And what is the main goal of your YouTube channel? Click text and then click add a heading, a subheading. Then you type, we build YouTube channel. So you type it this way and then you click on it and drag it to adjust it there. We build YouTube channels, okay? So you have to change the font come here to canvas sun here it's already on canvas sun you have to change the font which of the font do you want to use and then all you need to do is just to click on it like this okay so we build youtube channels you look at it adjust it to the middle so can you see that we build youtube channels okay so we are done with this first page right the next thing we want to do is to go to the next page just make a screen record and let the screen record just be for 15 seconds okay then you stop it i have a screen record here let me separate it you can see that remember i showed you this just like a continuation from our last page okay so you bring in the screen recorded video here and then you place it right here this is a screen record i did now the next thing you want to do after bringing in your video here is you want to edit it now look at it edit video okay click on edit video when you click on edit video how do you want it to be you can filter the video as you want let's say you want to use summer okay click on summer intensity you can reduce intensity increase intensity here okay and then that is all for that then the next thing you want to do look at this here cut okay it's the sign for cut the video is long we want to reduce it okay you can reduce your video here and here can you see all you need to do is to click here and reduce your video can you see that then you click done good now if you are recording your pictures you know whatever it is you are recording it comes in with volume okay so look at this here you, you see volume here click on volume just to stop it okay now you can increase the volume you can decrease the volume okay for me i don't like using the volume i take it all down and then that's all okay so now we are set go to position and then click backward to take the video backward on the screen and then that is all now you've taken it backwards okay so this is how it is let me play it and you'll see it 
can you see so the next thing you want to do is to download this intro and then we proceed to editing it using CapCut. click on share here to download when you come here click on download go to mp4 video okay and then you can increase the resolution to 4k can you see it here you can take it down you can reduce it you know so i want us to leave it at 1080 okay let it just be at 1080 then you click download but make sure it's on all two pages okay then you click download you wait for this to download look at it downloading here good can you see it's already downloaded okay we just go to place it where we want it to be placed and then that's all okay so you click it and then you take it to your desktop place it on your desktop there and that's all okay so this is how you can finish up the remaining part of your intro then the next thing we want to do is to go straight to how to edit our intro then it will now be ready for our youtube channel okay guys so now let's proceed with editing our youtube intro using CapCut. okay now this is CapCut interface when you open it it brings you here look at new project click on new project good when you click on new project it brings you here okay very blank there is nothing here so the next thing you want to do is to click on your import button when you click on import go straight to where you saved your intro okay where did you save your intro look at it here ultimate vid okay click on it and then click open to bring it right here this is your intro okay then you bring it here can you see this is your intro your intro is just nine seconds look at it here nine seconds only okay so when it brings you to this interface look at this button here minus and plus one is for zooming in another is for zooming out click on zoom in and then zoom it in like this so that you see very clearly okay so this is your intro what you want to start doing now is to add a background music to your intro but before you add background music to your intro where did the second page begin from i think is this place good now you want to go and cut it you put your cursor in here and then you go here look at this icon here click on it to split good you've splitted it okay we want to add transition look at transition here click on transition and then choose the one you want to use to transit to the next page okay so let's check this one out you click on it and then you click on the plus sign to add come and play and see can you see that okay it makes it very beautiful so now the next thing we want to do take your cursor to the end okay then go and add a background music can you see audio here please if you like this content i want you to subscribe to this channel and also like this video please okay thank you very much so click on audio we want to add music what is the name of the music you want to add to this youtube intro for me i have one just type happiness and then you search so i love using this it's a nice sound or you go for any other sound but please make sure your sound is not copyrighted okay then you click on this plus sign to add your sound okay now let's play and see can you see that the video has ended so what we want to do take the cursor here to the end of your intro video and then click on the music background and then go to split click on split so you have cut it from this place and this one so you click on backspace and delete it okay so if the volume of your background music is too low and you want to add more click on the music and then look at volume here you can double click and hold on this white icon here then you drag okay you can drag it to 10 you can leave it at 5 just at 5 okay now let's go and play again and listen to it can you see that very very interesting now the next thing we want to do we want to use fade out 
okay you click on fade out to reduce it can you see reduce it so that when it's ending it ends like that and then fade in uh, from the beginning also take it to eight and then leave it like this so let's play and see Can you see that now we want to add sound effects to our transition here okay come here we see audio okay then look at sound effect so click on sound effects when you click on sound effect which sound effect do you want to use these are different sound effects let's say this one uh, maybe you want to use this one let's play it and listen or oh, this one did you hear that so let's use this one click on this plus icon here when you click on it for me i would like to take this here to cut it off okay then come here and cut it off here okay then you drag it to where the transition begins from then you can also increase the volume of this sound effect okay so that it will be very loud take it down now let's go and play from the beginning and listen again. Did you hear that? Very beautiful, right? Please, if you like this video, subscribe and also like this content. And let's keep on dropping beautiful stuffs for you just like this one. Okay, so the next thing you want to do, the beginning of the intro, put your cursor there okay we want to add something else very very interesting something else that you would love okay so to do that click on the intro this is the intro click on it down when you click on the video down then you come to effects here can you see effects when you click on effect all of this open then which of the effects do you want to use for this video you search down here i love using this effect explosion okay click on it and then it's included already okay then you play and see. Can you hear that? Okay, so the next thing you want to do, let this sound come with an explosion, like you hear boom. Okay, so what you want to do, take your cursor down there, but before then, let's reduce the atmosphere of this explosion. Click on it down. Look at the atmosphere here, reduce it a little, it's okay. And then the speed, you can adjust the speed here or reduce the speed here as you want. Okay, so now take your cursor to the beginning of your video. What you want to add now is a sound effect. Click on audio, look at audio here, click on it and then go to sound effect. We are still there. Now you would type explosion and then you search. Now these are different types of explosions that we have here okay look at this one big bomb explosion did you hear that so we want to use that one click on the plus sign when you click on it it brings you here okay now let's play the whole thing and listen to it did you hear that so you can reduce the volume of the explosion a little click here and then take the volume down like this good so now let's go and play again and listen. Did you see this? So this is how you can edit your YouTube intro using CapCut. Very simple. So when you are done with all of this editing, come here, look at export here, click on export. And then you are to choose a resolution 480, 720, 1080, 2K, 4K. Okay. I love using 4K so that everything will be very clear, but you can use 2K or 720 if you don't have the data to upload a higher resolution of video. Okay. So you leave it at 7K here and then look at export to choose where you want your video to descend to okay i love leaving it at desktop then you choose select folder that's all okay and then the next thing is to click on download immediately just export look at it here click on export good you can see it has been exported click here to cancel so video is already on your desktop look at it here
Good. Can you see that? So that is how you can go about with all of this. Please, I want you to subscribe to this channel and like this video and share this video as well. Thank you very much for following.